morning. Welcome to Planet Mojo. Today, I'm going to be planting my test sample of Little Blue Stem. A little bit of fertilizer here. And I have my little blue stem. This is the sample I planted at the same time as I put the seed in the prairie patch. This is the sample from the, the second batch of seed that I also planted over there. For some reason, these are, these are like a week apart and they're very different. But anyways, let's go get these in the ground. Okay, I'm going to plant it right here because I don't see any little blue stem growing there. There might be some around here. It's pretty hard to identify this stuff when you got all this other grass growing up around it. That could be some right there, but I just don't know. I like that really tall stuff right there that has the really red stem. I do not think that's little blue stem, but having this this uh, chunk of it planted over here should help me out with identification. It's got really flat white stems and it's tillering right at the base, so that should help me. Yeah, that you can see on this one as well. They're coming out. Coming out off to the side there, straight out to the side. All right, let's get this in the ground. bit of map and K and then I'll water this in with some liquid fertilizer some very weak liquid fertilizer I'm going to use tomato because it is high in potassium and doesn't have excessive nitrogen. So a weak solution of that, a couple gallons of water, and then let it soak down in, and then plop that in. And I'll have a nice amount of water below it, as well as the high potassium fertilizer below it. So it should grow like crazy. 
I was scouting around looking for a place to plant the second batch. And there's tiny little, little blue stem. Well, actually smaller than that all over the place. And it, it definitely looks just like the stuff that's planted in this, in this little batch. So I don't think there's anything wrong with it. It's just that it takes that long to get started. It takes a very long time for this stuff to get started. See, there's some there. There's a whole bunch of little sprouts here. They're little fuzzy, fuzzy uh, stems there. So I don't think there's anything wrong with this stuff. We'll get it in the ground and it's gonna do fine. Okay, I got the hole watered in and a little bit of fertilizer added. We got mulch underneath it, which is going right in the hole with it. Uh, no, too late. It's gonna raise it up just a tad, but Try to uncover any little sprouts that I covered up, like these here, and a little one here, and I'll water this in, and that'll be that. Well, it looks like I got both of them. A little too deep, but I don't think it's going to make any damn difference in the world. And there it is. Wind's starting to pick up a little bit, so might get some extra noise on the camera. I didn't spray 2,4-D down here because these plants are younger, but right at this rock here is where I sprayed it, and most of the stuff is dying back. Okay, I'm going to water this stuff in. I just tossed a little bit of MAP plus potassium, it's 50-50. Just give it a little boost. Very low nitrogen, high in phosphorus and potassium. You can see it on the ground there. So I'm gonna water that in and then get over to the weed whacking. Thanks for watching. Uh, hit the subscribe button and make sure you click on notifications and you'll be notified when we upload new videos.